So here we go. 141 pounds. So 141 is on the mat. Elbow, elbow. So here you go. You're going to have David Bavery. Bavery going to be taking on one of the Lee brothers, two Lee brothers in a row. Avery, a state champion for, two-time state champion for the Nassau and Perry Panthers. So there is Avery in on a deep shot. Closed wizard there for Lee. Lee from Watkins Memorial. Some connection problems, but here we are at 141. David Bravery up early here. Um, Andrew Lieb, Lieb from Watkins Memorial. Lieb looking to get a reversal here on David Bravery. He's got Bravery in some trouble, and Andrew Lieb going to tie the score here with David Bravery at 141. You're looking at Lake Erie College in the green on top. Andrew Lieb from Watkins Memorial, Tascala. Shout out to Mark Neiman. Lead up, tied right now with David Bavery, gonna have to return him. Bavery, the Maslin Perry Panther state champ for Notre Dame College. Your national runner-up as a team last year and national runner-up and national duels two weeks ago. So Bavery, 3-2 lead here on the lead. So right now, David Bavery, 3-2 lead on Andrew Lieb, lead from Watkins Memorial High School in Patascala, Ohio, or Patascala, whichever you prefer the pronunciation of. Shout out to the mighty cruiser, Mark Neiman, as lead goes, or uh, check that, Bavery goes to the four point. Nice little duck, that was nasty, dropped onto a single. We're gonna cut across double now as lead. and then there's two, he had both legs. And there it is, 4-3 lead, lead. Now he's gonna have to work up above the waist. There should be a count right now. And now there's finally the count. It's gonna be a stall on lead with six seconds remaining. But that's actually a good one to give because now he's only gotta ride out five seconds through the ride out the period and take a 4-3 lead into the second. So kind of almost like he's stuck there though. I don't think lead could actually move up the body. So there's a roll by Bavery. Lead gonna hang on. And Lee gonna take a 4-3 lead into the second. Favor uh, Bavery, the ride time, 19 seconds in favor of Lee. So Bavery crawls back to the center. 9-0 dual score here. Once again, these duels are brought to you by Defense Soap. Defense Soap, defend what you've built. Shout out to guy Seiko. Go get some of the best product on the market to get the funk off your skin and keep it off. Defend what you've built. As I say that, Bavery underneath. Quite pods up, tries to roll, he somersaults over, he's looking for a reversal, he's got it. So now, just like that, 5-4 lead and headgear, they're going to stop it for David Bavery's headgear. So, back to the center, off the restart, 5-4 lead David Bavery from, from Notre Dame College, the Perry Panthers, two-time state champ, will cover Andrew Lee. So it looks like we're going to see two Perry Panthers in a row potentially. They have Jose Rodriguez uh, in there as well. And boot in, right boot in for Bavery. Cranking hard on Lee. Lee gets his hips back underneath and doesn't get stretched out. We're going to see two Leaves in a row as well. This is Andrew Lee, and next we're going to see Alexander. So. Nice job here, good ride, and the ride time is now shifted in the direction of Avery. Um, and Avery's got Lieb in some trouble, but Lieb's got Gumby shoulders. Holy smokes, Lieb. That guy's flexible. And I don't know how that, that's still, 
Avery's control, and they're going to give it to him. He's going to remain in control on that. So, Bavery going to cover. He's going to fight for lead. 101 remains here in the second. Bavery on top. Boot comes in auto boot. There it is. Auto boot. Not even like leave no attempt to even stop that. Or Ork didn't see it coming, maybe. I don't know. But right now, we're looking at David Bavery in control here versus Andrew Lead. Bavery Notre Dame College lead. Lake Erie College. Both Take Ohio it guys. It We're gonna see two lead brothers in a, in a row here. So Lake Erie College has two brothers in a row at 25, you got 30, let's and go. 41, 49. And right now, David Bavery put a hard ride and about to eclipse a minute of ride time. He's looking for a cradle there. Let's go! Lead underneath Bavery right now. And Bavery rides period, and he's going to take a 5 4 lead into the third with 116 of ride time. Choice, Lee, Lee will go underneath to start the third. Down effectively 6 to 4, 5 4 on the board, but the ride time point. With the ride time up over a minute for Bavery. This has been an exciting match thus far. We got some reversals. We got some stuff going on. And there's a roll. He tries to switch it. He's done this once before. And Lee switches it, and he's going to tie. He's going to go up on the board five to four, but he can eliminate that ride time. He has been dinged for stalling. He is going to have to return him. And he does in the quad pod for Bavery. And they're going to stall, and it's going to be a point in the ride time at 112 now in favor of Bavery. And there's a quick shot at the scoreboard. 132 remains. Lieb going to cut him loose. It's going to be. Should be 6 6 on the board. Or 7 6. And we've got a stall point, and we've got a. We've got a meeting of the minds. Frank Romano and uh, Coach Breeze over there are going to try and discuss some, some, something. A lot of brain power in that, that, that duo of Breeze and Romano. Uh, Frank Romano is 70 years old. So he's double the age of Jeff Breeze. Digest that, folks. That man has been in the sport of wrestling since he was probably like eight or nine years old. He's only been at it over 60 years. A couple NCAA team championships for Frank Romano, and I'm thinking Jeff Bree is going to bring a couple back here to Lake Erie eventually. I, li I like what they're doing. So we got 7 6 on the board, effectively 8 6 for Bavery on lead right now. And shot Bavery right handed head inside single leg. Nice job by Lead to get his hips back. And nice job there. Huge takedown, Bavery. That's probably going to ice this thing. And he's already on the boots. And Lead has done this a couple times. He like slips the leg and rolls through. And Bavery's got his arm behind his back hammer lock. And 55 seconds remains here in the bottle. Lee's gonna need some near fall here. He's gonna need something. Once again, shout out to Defense Soap bringing these duels to you. This duel brought to you by Defense Soap. Defense Soap, Defense Soap, Defense Soap. Lee's gonna have to try and find a way up off the mat. Right now, David Bavery putting some heat on him. And 30 seconds left here in the third period. David Bavery looking for near fall. There's the swipes now. And now they kind of won. Thought he had two there. And Bavery's gonna take a four point win here, it looks like. He's inside of 15 seconds. Now 10 remaining. He could actually be looking for a fall. And he slips him again. And he's, Lee is like a wizard with that. But uh, he's gonna end up losing 10 8. As Bavery has a ride time point, gonna be a 10 8 bout, but a spirited 10 8 bout. What a match. So Bavery with the win, and Notre Dame 12 0.